guys, Xdevon here, and today I'm going to be showing, showcasing some cars that just need to be added in Greenville. A lot of, so like, most of you would probably agree, but like, this is my opinion, so, um, yeah. Uh, so, first one, I would say the 2019 Kia Sportage, like, that's pr probably the most wanted car in Greenville, like, I used to love that car in GV3, we just need to get it in the GV4, like, we just need the 2019 Kia Sportage. Uh, I think it looks pretty nice, I kind of hate Kia, like, I just don't really like their design, don't really like their cars, but, um, not a bad brand, uh, but I, like, I love their 2019 Sportage. Uh, and so, next car on the list would probably be, like, the 2017 Toyota Sienna. Like, that thing in GV3, that thing was insane. It was, like, such a sleeper. Like, it was super cool. Uh, so, yeah, we definitely need that in GV4. Um, also, another good car we need is the 20, 2021 Chevrolet Blazer. Like, uh, I think Greenville started working on it already, but, uh, never got added, so I don't know what happened to that, but, um, it would be nice to see that car in the game. Uh, and yeah, uh, let's see what else. Um, we, uh, the 2022 Infiniti QX60 or 2023, I'm not sure which is the remodeled version, uh, in 2023, they, the Infiniti QX60, I'm not the biggest fan of it, doesn't look the greatest, but it still looks good. Uh, same, um, we also need the 2020 uh, Infiniti QX60, that would be nice to see in Greenville. Uh, and then what else can do we need in Greenville? Um... Hmm, like, there's a lot of vehicles that we just need in Greenville, like, a lot of cool cars. Uh, but I think it would be cool if Greenville added, like, um, tuned versions of cars, like, basically a customization place. Or, like, some cars, like the Infiniti G37 could have, like, a tuned trim. Uh, that would be cool. Uh... Um, Infinity FX, we probably, like, the 2015 Infinity FX, that little SUV, uh, yeah, we need that in Greenville. Uh, we also, oh, I can't believe I actually forgot about this car. The 2014 slash 2012 Ford Edge, like, we just, like, this, the 2012 Ford Edge slash 2014, that used to be, like, uh, when I was little, that was, like, my absolute favorite car, my dream car, basically. It's not really, like, my favorite car now, my dream car, but, like, I still like it. Just not as much as when I was little. Um, so, yeah, we definitely need that. Like, I've been waiting for that for a super long time. Um, and, yeah, let's move on to our next car. Um, let's see. What other cars do we need in Greenville? Uh, we definitely need a 2010 Ford F-150 Raptor, 2010 Ford F-150 Raptor. That would be pretty cool to see in GV. Uh, and a 2018 Ford F-150 Raptor or 2017, I'm not sure which one they have. That definitely needs a refresh, like, that totally, like, just outdated now. We also need, like, uh, like an actual 2017, a normal F-150. Uh, that would be nice to see. We need a 2023 Mercedes uh, C300, I'm pretty sure, AMG. I'm not sure if it's a C300 or C350 or anything, but we need the 2023 C-Class AMG. Pretty sure it has, like, a Turbo i4 or an i6. I'm not that sure, but um, I have heard it's definitely not a V8. It's, like, one of the smaller engines. Uh, yeah, so new Mercedes is, like, I mean... I mean, we have a lot, but, like, we need some 2023s. Uh, we also need, like, some... We need some more, like, 2010 BMWs, Audis, Mercedeses. Uh, like, they added in a 2015, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. 2017 or 2015 RS3, which is, like, one of the 2010 German cars, I guess. Um, and, yeah. 
so I could just keep going on with the list like forever but um yeah but these are definitely some cars that are needed in Greenville uh, comment down below uh, more cars I should add in part two and yeah so hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next video Xtivan out <laughs>